Hello dear friends, welcome to another video of NS Pharma. Today we are going to see one important topic which is very useful for those who is writing, who is planning to write pharmacist exams or GPAT, NIPER or even a drug inspector exam. So the topic is pharmacist requirement and hospital floor space. Number of pharmacists required for an hospital and as well as hospital floor space. So this is the topic. This is a very important topic. You can expect one question from this one uh, in almost all the exams, competitive exams. So without wasting time, let us start. everyone welcome to NS Pharma YouTube channel for pharmacists. If you like the video please make thumbs up and click the subscribe button and bell button for notification. First of all floor space requirements. The floor space of an hospital depends upon its bed strength. If the bed strength is less than 100 then that hospital should have minimum of 250 square feet floor space whatever i mentioned here in the digit in is in square feet so 250 square feet is required to any hospital any sized hospital which have less than 100 beds even it is 50 even it is uh, 20 also it should have 250 square feet floor space Suppose one hospital have more than 100 beds but less than 200 beds then that hospital's floor space should be 10 square feet per bed. That means for 100 bed, 100 bedded hospital it should be 100 into 10 that means 1000 square feet floor space. If it is 150 bedded hospital then the area of the floor space will be 150 into 10 that means 1500 square feet floor space like that that is in between 100 and 200 if suppose one hospital has 200 bed then then hospital then that hospital should have floor space of 6 square feet per bed So for the 200 bedded hospital 6 into 200 that means 1200 square feet floor space should be there it's up to 1000 if suppose the hospital is large that means the hospital have more than thousands bed strength then each bed should get 5 square feet that means the floor space will be 4000 bedded hospital is 5000 square feet floor space so for more than 1000 it should be 5 square feet per each bed we are moving to next part pharmacist requirement pharmacist requirement is also based on the bed strength if there are 50 bed in an hospital the pharmacist required minimum pharmacist required is 3 if suppose 100 bed is there in a hospital minimum of 5 pharmacists are required in that hospital for a 200 bedded hospital there should be minimum of 8 pharmacists for 300 bedded hospital minimum of 10 pharmacists are required if the bed strength is 500 then pharmacist required will be 15 so 15 pharmacists are required for 500 bedded hospital okay thank you guys for watching this video and uh, if you didn't subscribe until now my channel please subscribe the channel and also press the bell button so that uh, you will get a notification regarding new videos thank you